what is up ladies and gentlemen my name is Treatafix and I'm back with another tutorial um, for you a lot of people ask me uh, how I make my uh, speed arts uh, how I choose music how I put in my video borders on uh, how I render them out um, the videos and um, today I'm going to give you some tips show you my ren render settings and um, we will create some video borders for our uh, speed art and um, yeah that's it um, the first thing the first tips I want to give you is um, always feel comfortable like if you don't feel good don't design anything like uh, if you're under stress because of school or family or whatever just don't make something if you don't feel good uh, don't make anything that uh, the whole outcome is shit then uh, I have I'm, I'm in the situations uh, a lot of uh, times now and um, I know it I when I come back from school I do my stuff my homework or whatever um, I eat something and um, be sure to make a coffee or whatever just feel comfortable you need to be in front of your um, computer in front of your Photoshop and Cinema 4D and just feel comfortable so you have a good feeling and be able to create something good that's a big 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 influence to your designs to your speed art um, I think to your to all of your videos um, that's the first thing the second tip I want to give you is um, be sure to make a concept you don't have to write anything down or something but just be sure to uh, um, to thought about it before like uh, maybe you had an idea a few days ago for the speed art I, if somebody asks me to do a speed art or background and he wants to upload it I normally take um, five five to five four no so, sorry uh, five to seven days um, to think of it um, just think of colors I could use or uh, textures or images or some ideas like um, I don't know uh, put in a little picture of him like I did for Chris and um, yeah uh, if you have a client you're working for um, just be sure to have all his uh, uh, requirements like if he wants um, some red in it on two or three different 3d textures or um, a special picture or whatever write it down or have it somewhere where you can look at it so you don't forget anything um, just be sure to do it and um, yeah if I did all this stuff like if I'm feeling comfortable and I made some ideas or had some ideas I can begin with my speed art the software I'm using is a screen flow um, this is a program uh, this it's it's only for Mac uh, I think and um, for you Windows users uh, you can have uh, Camtasia which is a good program I think and um, Fraps but that's I think that's uh, good for gaming stuff but not that good for uh, recording speed ads. I'm not sure but um, I'm going to try to find a good render settings tutorial for you guys uh, who only have Camtasia or something like that I'll put it in the description and um, yeah what I'm going to show you now is my render settings for uh, ScreenFlow and now we start with it um, this is the speed up I made for Chris uh, you should have see it, seen it already it's on my channel it's a pretty good background it's uh, over f the, the original video is over 54 minutes long and um, it's pretty long but um, yeah that's it if you have recorded it I think you should uh, know everybody should know how you can uh, start recording a video like this um, if you're done with it uh, we are going to go to our uh, render settings now um, if you have it just go up second button um, and click on it and just go to export or you can um, press command and E to export the video 
the first thing is uh, where we want to save our video. I'm just going to make it on my, uh, I don't know, designs, treat, videos. Just make a new folder, tutorial, um, speed out. Okay, um, that's my place where I want to save it. I just call it SF1 for screen flow one. And then we go to presettings, go to web and high and then to uh, this button, little button up here and click on it, go to compression. Even if it's uh, already um, put in H264, just go on it and click on it again and you see something changes, that's good. And now we put this one from uh, 75 to optimal, press OK, that's good. Just click OK again and then we go to uh, scale your own size, click on it, and just make it the size, ah, oh, I'm sorry, we forgot something. We forgot the size. Now, if you go back um, to your settings where you put in the compression, uh, just go to size, click on the size, and you can choose now what you want. I would um, give you some tips. Uh, I almost do every speed out in 720p, which is HD, uh, 1280 by 720 that's a good um, size for speed art and my tutorials I'm always doing in 1080p so I'm going to do um, 720p now just click on it press ok press ok again and now we're here again go to scale your own size and press in the um, size you uh, made before like 1080 by 720 that's it. Go to export. You will see uh, it will take some while. And um, yeah, I'm going to show you if uh, while this is loading or rendering, I'm going to show you where we can look for good music. A lot of people ask me uh, how I use my songs or where I find my songs. And um, all of you should know a few. Um, free copyright, no copyright um, channels on YouTube. I'm just going to make a new tab and then like, what is good? Tell me something. Pandora Music. Oh, sorry. Pandora Music. That's a pretty good site. LOL. Okay, I made a, made a mistake. Then we go to my uh, friend's channel, Zebo's channel. Um, five tunes, they upload some pretty sick um, um, songs you can go on here um, sometimes they put in a little download link for the vi uh, for the songs you can download them um, be sure that it's not copyright if you're not sure um, just and you want for example the noise storm song uh, just look for noise storm on YouTube you can write him uh, write him a message uh, saying um, hey I want to use your music uh, could I have your permission Maybe if you're partnered, uh, ask him or tell him that you um, could earn a few dollars uh, by making a video with his song. Just ask him for permission. That's then you you're safe with it. And I'm going to put a few um, non-copyrighted uh, music channels in the description, so you can look for a few songs. I don't know you pick just a song whatever you want and um, yeah sorry and um, that's it with the render settings that's it yeah just render it out and um, um, we will see us uh, in the next part of my tutorial um, where I'm going to show you how to make the final um, the final speed art and put in the song and uh, make some video borders. So I hope you liked the first part of the tutorial. Uh, be sure to watch out or to look out for the second part. Um, it would be nice if you could give me uh, a like and a favorite maybe, I don't know. And it would be pretty nice. Um, and um, yeah, thanks for watching guys and see you soon.